Thanks for coming back. Um, so previously I shared that in my view that the two biggest challenges that we as ADHD business owners face are organisation and completing tasks. Our brains are all over the place. We're always looking for that next thing. Um, for me, I solve both with one very simple method and it's what I call the two diaries approach. So I always have two diaries each day and I use them as to-do lists. First diary is, as new things come in, they get written on that. And it saves me having to go and dive straight into them sometimes. It helps me focus on, actually, I can relax. It closes the loop. It allows me to know that it's there. I can come back to it when I want to. And it doesn't come off that page until it's done. Or I choose not to do it. There's two, two things. Then I have a daily diary. And the daily diary is made up of all of the short-term urgent tasks that need doing from that first diary or some of the bigger tasks that I decide I'm going to conquer today and that helps me get past the procrastination side of things as well. So making sure that you're challenging yourself every day and breaking down one of those big rocks that stands in the way of your business being a success. A couple of those in so it's manageable. A few of the more urgent tasks, obviously all the urgent tasks need to get done, all the important or urgent tasks I should say and they go into the short-term diary and they get scratched out. And by the end of the day, that diary has to be clear. That page has to be completed or it moves into the next day's stuff. So anything that doesn't get completed gets moved into the next day because sometimes things get in your way, right? Um, but I do also challenge myself that if anything stays on that short-term diary for more than a couple of days, is it actually that important that we get it done? Because I haven't done it yet. So either I don't want to do it or it's not important. If I don't want to do it, it has to be the next thing I get done. Otherwise, it's never going to get done. Whether we want to do it or not, you need to take your frog and you need to eat it. And by using the two diaries approach, I made myself extremely organised and I always complete what I start. I'd love to hear what your experience is with it and how you get around those two particular challenges. What's your tips and tricks for everybody else out there? Let's, let's share this around and see if we can help each other.